so today we will start our new chapter multimedia in this chapter i would be covering two topics by giving basic idea or the introduction about multimedia and what are the type of elements that we use for multimedia so what is multimedia well a multimedia came from the two words multi which means many and media means modes or forms of communication now there are various form of multimedia elements those are in textual format graphics format audio format video format and the last one is animation which is a combination of about four formats now these type of elements we normally use in our daily life textual format that we use is a newspaper magazine books all those information that we write using a document editor like notepad word pad ms word those textual documents can be written using these softwares the next element is audio now whenever we record anything any songs any audio recording we use different type of format few of the popularly known formats are mp3 and wma that stands for video media audio third one is graphics graphics is something which is related to picture or images so those images can be saved in the form of jpeg that stands for joint picture export group bmp and png which is also two popular formats fourth one is a very crucial one which is video which is a form of audio graphic as well as text so any video whatever we see in day to day's life is in mp4 format that is multimedia player 4 and wmv which is a extension of windows media player in video format that is windows media video so these are the main and the common multimedia elements and combination of these elements are used in animation as we all know animations are nothing but those are motion pictures so whenever any animated movies are made we found these above four elements present in an animated movies so now i will show you the popular software that we use using these multimedia elements let me minimize this page so if you click on start and in the search box if you type notepad you will find this popular textual editor or a text editor where you can type letters in a document format second one is ms word that if you click on the search box you'll find the second text editor which is also a graphics editor because in this multimedia element you can add images also you can add videos also so it is not only a text editor 
but it is also a graphics editor then if you want to play any song you use vlc player which is one of the common player that we use to play songs and videos so the interface of this one looks like this the second one which is a very popular in windows is windows media player so it's not being configured you can configure it one this one so this window media player looks something like this so it is also used to play songs and videos then a graphics editor a graphics editor you very well know is ms paint so it is used to create images drawings and different stuff other popular graphic editor that we have come across is tux pin and in future you would be knowing few more advanced graphics editor like photoshop gimp which have different type of effects graphics effects and different type of video effects also and there you can create animation using different type of frames so today this is the end of the topic that i have covered i hope you would have a brief idea about multimedia what is multimedia and multimedia elements in the coming session we would be dealing with few more topics where i will explain you in detail so till then stay tuned so bye